Welcome to my nautical slash paint decor. <laughs> and don't look at my storage room to the left. Oh my gosh. I've collected a lot of fishing reels. Not a lot, but a handful. They have the look. And then I added uh, hunting licenses because I couldn't find any little fishing licenses, but I loved the little frame license. And then I've got old bobbers, tons of old bobbers. There's an old postcard and just an old print of a uh, bathing beauty. And then there's another little reel. I love the fishing reels and the old bobbers. There's something about them. I don't know. I just love it. Then I made this lamp. It's pretty cool. I just tied keys with muslin shreds, put it on a spindle. There's a little pastry um, wooden form measure. I don't know. It's, they would make pastries on it. Um, and then there's my ducks. I love my old ducks. They're just so cool. They're duck decoys. And you can see the one on the right has the original rope that laid in the water. That's pretty cool. But I thought they went well together. They can get a little pricey, but I think they're worth it. Um, the one on the right, I think they both still have like the fin underneath them, but all of that is displayed in a little old drawer and I have some, uh, old brushes with a really cool old paint sign and these old brushes really are all so different. I've enjoyed looking for brushes. I mean, these things have taken me years to find, so, you know, you're not going to go out and get everything in one day, but just to inspire you. I thought I would show you how I mix kind of painting and nautical together. I don't know why, but I think it works. Oh yeah, and check out the little, uh, the gear shift on the top of my lamp. I love that lamp. I just tied keys with muslin shreds. And thank you for watching. <laughs>